All owners of the second gen Peugeot 308 and others too might be familiar with this situation. You try to refuel from a canister but it's not happening. I'll discuss this today. Here's a brief introduction for those not in the know. The car's tank has a specific valve which does not allow you to insert a standard fuel nozzle into the filling neck. Let's say from the 95th gasoline naturally we have a diesel car and it seems like a good idea and a valuable goal. You might give the car to your wife for instance and not worry that she'll screw up and fill it with gasoline instead of diesel fuel. Just to be clear, I'm not trying to offend anyone. So here's another issue. The valve is not simple. You might think it's enough to just press on it with a screwdriver and it will open. It's not that easy. The valve is designed in such a way that it opens on an even pressure all around the perimeter of the hole. And you can't put in something of a different diameter, for example a watering can, which is only half a centimeter narrower. To be completely honest, it is enough to press from two opposite sides to open the valve, but believe me, it's in. In any case, two hands, in the third that you have a funnel, in the fourth canister, in short, it is very inconvenient. But of course, there are a number of solutions to this problem. Option one, there is a special adapter. It purposefully designed for such cars, if anything. This is not only a feature of Peugeot, so we bought it. Don't worry about such an adapter, but its cost is about $20 and I somehow like it. It's a little annoying. No, I understand nanotechnology. Oil is a petrol resistant plastic, but $20 for this one, a piece. Well, somehow too much as for me, but it's up to you, the option. Number two, to do something on your own. Here, as they say, as far as your imagination is enough. And before I show you how I did it personally, the manufacturer carefully pointed out that it is possible to fill up the fuel, just pour it into the neck without any adapters. Just avoid touching the valve and pour slowly. The process seems simple enough if you're pouring from a small 5 liter container. Pouring from a 20 liter canister into a 30 liter one is a bit more challenging, but it's doable. That's what the manufacturer says. They've also pointed out that if you're traveling to another country, they don't specify which, you might encounter issues with refueling. Maybe the nozzle won't fit, these things happen. So don't worry, contact the Peugeot service center in your country before you leave. They'll tell you that, for example, in Kazakhstan or Belarus, not everything is perfectly set up and the gas nozzles there aren't always the right diameter. That was a bit of a tangent, maybe it will help someone. Anyway, let's get back to what I did. I decided to keep it simple. I bought an inexpensive collapsible funnel why that one? Simply because it costs around 4 or 5 dollars. Next, this funnel has a spout with a diameter of 21 mm. We need to make 25 mm for diesel, so we take some metal object. Specifically, I took a head for 14, but here, depending on the what form you have, is not the essence. Next, we heat the tip of our funnel, either on gas or as I use a hair dryer. You don't need to heat the whole watering can, just the very tip, and expand it with a little pressure. The hole is up to 25 mm. There is nothing complicated here. I did it in two stages, just... And let's not rush. You should get something like this. Let's say, the shape of a pipe. That's it. Great, it worked. Insert it. Press slightly. Everything opens. What is the bonus of the collapsible funnel? It is compact. A little less space in the trunk, a trifle. But nice. Further, with its help you can just fill that in the tank, or you can disassemble and say insert the right gun if the gun is thin, but with a diesel, this seems to happen. Also, with the help of a collapsible watering can, you can easily add additives to the fuel. Many owners pour various chemicals, and since we are talking about all sorts of additives, then as an alternative, you can use option number three, the funnel that comes with many additives from Liquid Molly. Well, and not only from them actually, but here check the diameter. The outer diameter should be 25 mm, but that's the way it is by the way. Perhaps someone will be interested, well I guess that's it, subscription, like, comments, all this is welcome, but that's all for today. Good luck on the roads for now.